Hey, I'm the Chad, and we are continuing our Halloween horathon with The Bridge Curse 2, The Extradition. I never played The Bridge Curse 1. I have it. It's been highly recommended, but I haven't played it yet. But this looks pretty good. So uh, this is part of, this is like a Next Fest demo. So let's jump in here and uh, see what this is all about. This film depicts a murder that took place in Wenhua University's Da Ren building in 1960. I, I've got to get out of here. You are mine. Shu Yo Yi. Even if I die, I'll never get away from you. How? How is this possible? I. He. No. No! This building traps the souls of all who die here. Shu Yo Yi. We will be together forever. The Hexed Building. September 14th, 7 o'clock. Screening room. Be there or beware. What the fuck? Here we go. I was like, damn, is it just a trailer? Hello, Mrs. Wong? Sue? Where the heck are you? I'm out in the field reporting. Oh. Wait, what? In the field? Lynn was just telling me that you're refusing to be put on the entertainment beat. Oh, I, um... No, it's not like that, Mrs. Wong. Recently, I haven't been feeling well. Perhaps I didn't make myself clear. Uh, all right, all right. So where'd you run off to? I called you more than ten times and it kept saying you were out of range. I just got to Wenhua University. I'm guessing the connection isn't too good up here. Wenhua? Oh, those film students and their ghost sighting video. Bingo! It's ghost month. And with this being a creepy ghost story, I figured I could get an exclusive. Come on, Sue. There's no way the school will let you touch that with a ten-foot pole. We basically smeared them with that report on the Huang Ting Ting missing persons case. How about picking something else? No way, Mrs. Wong. That's exactly it. If I can get something, this story is gonna like totally go viral. Ah, <sighs> fine. It gets pretty spooky up there at night. Be careful, will ya? Yep. Thanks, Mrs. Wong. Awesome voice acting so far. C is crouched, damn. Sucks. Ooh. F is interactive. That's good. Okay. Looks like we have one picture. It's a mysterious letter. Can't read that. Here we go. A mysterious photo that Su Leon is carrying with her. On the back, written in warped red letters, reads When Hua University Registrar's Office, help me, reporter Su Lin. Wong Ting Ting. Okay. And then our badge. Employee ID for the well-known media outlet United News makes it easy and convenient for journalists to show their identity to relevant personnel. As the name Lian Shu Yu on it, as well as the job title Reporter. Okay. Eight. What we got here? A red envelope. Inside the envelope is some hair and a hundred yuan yin note. The four pillars of destiny for a specific individual are written on the back. Folk superstition believes that if you want to find a suitable marriage partner for someone who has passed, you can place a red envelope on the ground and wait for their fated partner to pick it up. Uh-oh. I should not have picked that up. I didn't. I didn't. I'm going to leave it there. I, I didn't touch it. I heard about that shit. It's crazy what they do. So, if people die without being married first... They arrange ghost weddings, and sometimes the so what they're supposed to do, which is already creepy, 
is fine. Like, so like if a guy dies, they're supposed to find like a chick that died that wasn't married. And then they'll give them like a ghost wedding or something. But there's like a black market of people who like kidnap and murder women just to be like, like, cause they find like the most attractive looking ones and stuff and like, check this out. You're, you're who shoot would have loved this lean lean or whatever. And, uh, yeah, it's, it's really bad. It's nuts. Okay. Did we miss anything over here? I like that the like little icon shows up far enough away that you won't miss stuff too easily. Here we go. Hey, what? <laughs> Just a security guard. Hit him with a bat. Jimmy Christmas. What the fuck? Hey, buddy. Causing trouble, eh? We just carry a cat with us to get out of here. What? This is really cool. Very suspenseful. The voice acting is incredible. It'd be kind of cool if they had like a bit of a Japanese accent, honestly, but it's okay. What's this? Promotional poster for a horror movie shot by the film club. The film is a reenactment of Darren murder, which occurred on campus many years ago. The trailer went viral due to an apparent ghost sighting that was caught on camera. It sparked heated discussion online concerning whether or not this was just some post-production ploy to get views. What a trailer. It'll be a hit for sure. <laughs> okay. Let's find our way in. So that guard came from this way. Why is the lid on the box? It's kind of weird. I can't look down any further. This is as far as I can go. It's going to make it hard to like interact with things that are really close by, I feel like. Okay. Do to dim lighting and the safety hazards that this incurs. Loitering in or around Denra building is strictly prohibited after midnight, at which time the doors will be locked. Please leave the building at appropriate time. Still got two hours. And tell me to leave, bud. I press T to use your cell phone. Okay. A horror-themed welcome event that Wind Hua students clearly put a lot of work into. The fact that it's held during Ghost Month really enhances the atmosphere. 2016 Carnival of Horror. Winwa's 24th annual recruitment event. Hosted by Dadada, all activities are held with the safety as primary concern. No need to worry. Can we call back unknown? Did, did you get it? Hello? What? Who is this? The letter. It was so, so difficult to get to you. Wonderful. Oh, ho, 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 shit. Let's call them back. No, I didn't mean to call you, Mrs. Wong. Oh, one more thing. If anything happens, don't hesitate to call me. 
Huh? Now that you're covering entertainment, I'm responsible for you, Sue. All right already. Get to it. On this creep back. Hello? Excuse me, miss. Did you dial the wrong number? I often see you on the TV. Ah. Oh. Well, thank you. Please. Well, that's all. Oh, shit. What about messages? My dad. Um, Sue, you're not coming home tonight? Yeah, I have a case I need to investigate. Tell mom for me. Didn't they put you on entertainment? What the heck do you need to investigate for that? You know your mom was really worried about you when you were chasing cases or what have it. You really should just quit. Apply for a government job. It's a stable income, and it's good work, trust me. We'll be around the bush. We'll be nice to our dad. Dad signals not good up here. Gotta get to work. Get some rest tonight. Night. Okay, at least let us know when you're finished. Love you. Okay. Let's go. Shit, where do we want to go? Let's go up one floor. Okay, is the cafeteria, it looks like. You can move really fast in this game and it's very smooth and fluid. I do like it a lot. Oh no. Okay, sorry about any screen tearing up until now. I think I got rid of it. Oh. Ew. Some unknown remains were left in the student cafeteria. Where the hell do these bones come from? You and Stu? Store? It's not. Okay, so I think anything you click on will have that little symbol. Which is kind of cool. One thing that drives me crazy about most horror games is like when you just can't find what you need to find. I go when the objects are highlighted in some way. Because ultimately, aren't we here for the story? For the experience, not for the puzzle of it. At least me. Okay, let's go to another floor. One. Woozy hand. Hey, Nizan, just checking. The key to the registrar's office is in the military instructor's room, right? Yeah. So you are serious. Whoa, OMG. Fucking wild. I appreciate the help for not asking too much. The post said urgent. High pay. Part time work. Looks like a scam for sure. I'm investigating a case. Couldn't really discuss the details. Again, thanks for the help. As we agreed on, I'll arrange for a print interview with the film club. Okay, okay, thanks. Okay, I'm gonna find this military office. What's this? Amplet uh, for new students that includes a 2D map of the building. Take it if you get lost. Oh, nice. Good. Did that already. Doors on this side, right? So oh, somebody's in there. Uh oh. <laughs> we are 
but hey turn off the flashlight already jeez Ugh. old fart like me I never get any goddamn rest uh, well guess I better make myself busy Okay, stealth. Watch out, enemies will not only hear sounds that you make when you're moving, they'll notice the sounds of items you bump into, or other noises in the surrounding environment. So gonna catch us. No. We are dead. We are dead. We are dead. Don't come this way. Can't tell. Oh no. Let's wait for him to leave. Hopefully he doesn't come in too far. And maybe he does. No, oh, get some. <laughs> See ya. See ya. Probably sneak behind him now. Shit. Yes, 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 yes. I think we got it. That's right. Woohoo! Ha <laughs> Okay, come on, down the stairs. Yes. We are so getting into that registrar's office. Nice. Oh, right there. <laughs> we were right by it. Key, please. Let's use it. Nice. Okay. Okay, let's find information on the computer. Can't read this stuff. Can I print it, maybe? Can I forward the email to myself? Wait, what did it just say? Shit, I didn't read that. Military instructor notice, friends and students loitering. Okay, you know that. Uh, dear friends and students, you have bizarre rumors circulating online about the disappearance. Okay. And the ghost in Hex building. Looks like campus is at it again. Okay. Uh, follow up on Huang Ting Ting case. On the day that the student went missing, we cooperated with the police and showed them the surveillance footage from the main entrance. We confirmed that she had not left campus. Wang Ting Ting did not live in the dorms and would usually not take a bus or taxi to leave the mountain and return home. Based on accounts given by students who saw her last, she was last seen in the Da Ren building. Once again, it's the Da Ren building, just like the dance department incident that happened 10 years ago. The security guard discovered something strange in the elevator surveillance footage. After notifying the higher-ups, they held a secret meeting and decided to only provide the police with the first half. 
Everybody agreed that giving the police the master tape would do nothing to help the case. All right. Hopefully there's nobody in here. All geometric board? A transparent board with some geometric patterns on it. Looks like there's more than one of these. It also resembles those paintings on the wall. How could they be connected somehow? Paintings on the wall. The paintings on the wall. There's another. Another odd geometric board. You know, oh, okay. This one. Okay, and then this one. There. A unique geometric art. Cool. Info. A piece of art made by putting together two transparent boards. It forms various shapes when you look at it from different angles. It is trying to get at something profound. Is it trying to get at something profound? Is that like the map? Well. Oh, look, it spells out ghoul. <laughs> I don't know if it's supposed to. I mean, I think that's not how you spell ghoul, but it does spell ghoul. Ah, shit. Okay, hold on now. This is profound. Nine zero zero. The hell's an L supposed to be? Seven thousand six. Is that a seven? Is the red a seven? And then blue was six. And these other two have to be zero, right? Damn. I like these kind of puzzles. I actually got that, like, right away. Oh, shit. Jeez. Can't believe it's still here. Nice. But where the heck can I even play this thing? Ooh. Damn. Oh, come on now. I'm not that ugly, am I? Didn't mean to scare you there, freshman. <laughs> you okay? Yeah, I'm oh. fine. Hmm. You don't look like much of a student. Bit old, I'd say. What with all that pretty makeup and whatnot. Hmm. Oh. Uh oh. Sue Leanne, I'm a reporter for United News. Well, what do you know? You're that sweetheart anchor from the TV, aren't you? I'll tell you what, that screen don't do you justice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, anyway, I'm here to interview some students. Oh, this late? Um, yeah, they must be busy or something. Let me see if I can get a hold of them. Hmm. Hi, I'm sorry, but the person you called is not available. Please leave your message after the tone. Not picking up? <laughs> Wait, how can they just leave you hanging like that? Uh, sorry. Looks like he's busy at the moment, but... Uh, hey, Sarge, can I interview <clears throat> you instead? No, no, It no, can no. be about anything. Uh, the campus, so. the school's history. Hmm. My boss wants me to do a report on Wunhua. Or maybe you could, like... Tell me a story or something? Oh, I gotcha. Can't go back empty-handed, huh? Uh, oh, oh, lucky you. I've got so many stories that I... Um, well, you came to the right guy. <laughs> I know everything there is to know about Wenhua uh, University. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but I'd feel like a damn fool standing around blabbing my head off. <laughs> 
Let's go to the cafeteria. What do you say? I'll be more comf- What the hell was hmm. that? Sounded like something fell down and slammed into the floor. Yeah, yeah. Uh, let me go make sure everything's okay. You, just wait here. Be back in a few. Not going anywhere. Oh, that's why she fell down, huh? Okay. Now let's find a VCR. That was pretty loud. Better check it out. Why? Why? Security guard's on it. We want to play this tape. And he told us not to leave. We don't lose our scoop. See if going downstairs does anything. This is where we were, right? Hopefully he's still here. Yep, yeah, still waiting on us. AGG. <laughs> oh, again? What again? You okay? Need some help? Sue, what the whooping hell are you doing here? Nah, it's nothing. I'll take care of it. Oh, uh, blood stain on the floor. Uh, what? How's this? I was just about to buy a drink. You want one? Sure. Whatever works. Alrighty. Come on now. Uh -huh. Take a seat. Classic. This will do the uh -huh. job. So, uh, where should we start? Or what do you want to know? If it has to do with Wen Hua, I probably know about it. Ask away. Um, well, what do you know about the Huang Ting Ting missing persons case? Huang Ting Ting? Hmm. Her. Oh, yeah. What a shame. She was a good kid. Did you know her? Yeah, you could say that. But didn't she end up dead? A body was never found. So... The police just left it as a missing persons case. Hmm. He did it. I see. But after all these years, I'm assuming that she... Yeah, yeah. I figured the same. Hey. How'd you get that video? It's all over the internet. You haven't seen it? Internet? I'm not too good with computers. And now they've got those tables, tablets... Ugh, I don't use that stuff. Hey, wait. Why'd you ask about that girl? Actually, I did a special report on the Huang Ting Ting case a while back. Seeing that elevator again made me think of her. You seem to know so much about the place. I figured I'd ask. Hmm. True, true. I've spent so much time up here alone. It's amazing how fast time passes. It must be tough having to stay up here so late. Nah. It's not like I've got anywhere else to go. You get used to it. You... Um... Don't get along with your wife? She passed away a long time ago. From an accident. Oh. Oh, sorry. Ah, it's fine. He's a serial killer, I bet. Lucky here. Such a beautiful nurse. Do you know how long it took me to win her over? <laughs> she really is gorgeous. She ran the nurse's office here. Bunch of brainless bozos back then. Students would go see the nurse for a damn paper cut. Ugh, if it wasn't for what happened. Sorry. Don't worry about it. Listen to me, huh? I'm blabbing on about myself. Pretty boring, huh? Oh, not at all. I'm just glad that you're willing to talk to me. 
It's been a long time since I've had someone to chat with. Thanks. You rest here a while. I'll take you to the school history room whenever you're ready. Mm. Thanks. Okay. Tell the sergeant you want to go to the school history room. Yeah, what's that? Let's go. Good to go. Alrighty. Oh, sorry about that. This old elevator's a piece of crap. Let's take the stairs. Get some exercise. Alright. It was the first thing this morning when we started playing this. It is now nighttime. Let's see. What ends up happening? Hello, sir. Professor! Uh? Professor. This here's Professor. <laughs> He's been here longer than I have. His real name Where? is Pooty. But everyone just calls him Professor. Okay, Where's Pooty? Professor? <laughs> You're quite the character. <laughs> A touching love story about a relationship destined by the gods of fate between a human and a spirit that has possessed a vending machine. What? Is there supposed to be a dog here? Because there's no dog. What it is you're looking at? Ah, kids these days. Nothing seems to scare them. Are you worried something might happen? I heard this place is haunted. Haunted? Yeah. If it's before midnight, they can do whatever the hell they want. This is the school's founder, Shu and Shong, right? Somebody did their homework. <laughs> <laughs> he was a good guy, but his eyes really did him dirty. Huh? No, uh, nothing. The fellow wore glasses is all. Nah, he was harassing the youngsters, wasn't he? <clears throat> <clears throat> Darren Building Floor Plans. Darren was designed by a well-known expatriate architect. Over the years, he has won countless awards for his outstanding architectural designs. And there's that one guy. Talk of the school. And here's the school history room. Everything about the history of Wenhua and the Darren Building can be found here. Take your time. If you've got any questions, just ask. Darren building construction completed. School founder Zhu Wenzhong posing with the board of directors. Built in 1959, Darren Building was named after the ideals of preservation and fortitude in the hopes that students would cultivate such principles and incorporate them into the character. Wenhua University is composed of four major schools totaling an area of approximately 165 acres. Located in the mountains, the views are breathtaking and the air is crisp and refreshing, helping to cultivate the student's world view and moral character. Oh, you want to take some photos? Mm -hmm. What a fancy camera. In any case, yeah, you can take pictures, but just make sure not to take any of me. Ah, uh, scared? Yeah, my spectacular physique. <laughs> I don't want your camera to explode. <laughs> okay, I'll make sure you're not in any.
That's a camera, huh? Looks like an iPhone. That's fake for sure. Huh? What makes you say that? Look at how new it is. Does that look like it's from the 60s? This building's supposed to be built with the eight trigrams in the right order. Huh. Which would mean it should drive out evil spirits. And this area is teeming with yin and yang energy, and we're on a mountain. It's extremely important to order them properly. Mm. And their direction and angles must be perfectly aligned. Even worse, they were purposefully reversed. When placed in the reverse order, it draws in evil energy and keeps it trapped inside too. Which means, anyone who dies here turns into a ghost and is unable to escape. Not to mention the constant influx of evil spirits. Wow. Sure know a lot about Feng Shui. Impressive. <laughs> Just a little. I started doing some research later on. <sighs> if only they hadn't screwed up when they built this place. They just built what they were given. Who would have guessed the architect would purposefully mess with the trigrams? It's got nothing to do with the builders. Hmm. Hmm. True. Ah, hmm. about the rumors of this place being haunted? You've been here for quite some time, so you must have seen a ghost or two, right? Ghosts, eh? Mm-hmm. Yeah, but it sure as hell wasn't one or two. Hmm. How do I put this? Wait. Ghosts and spirits. <sighs> you can't talk about that in your report, can you? Um... Well... Whoa! It's already 11.34! Alrighty, right. About time to get going. You mind if I snap a few more photos of the elevator? No, no, no. Time to be going, Sue. Apologies. <laughs> What's the date? August 21st? And soon to be the 22nd. No wonder. Uh, don't mind me. Do whatever you need to do. Uh, uh, do you think ghosts really have calendars? Mind? No! Hey, and don't go running around. It's late. Make sure you leave before midnight. This would kind of be a perfect place for a demo to end. I wonder if I can play a video in the screening room. Man, this is so good so far. I'm definitely going to stream this. Like, the story is just so damn great. Most horror games don't have, like, such a deep story. So, I see why this was the original one, at least, was recommended to me. Whenever I was saying I wanted uh, some horror games that were just more story-based and not, like, key-finding games. Elevator is broken. What is she doing? Oh, she's scared. This reminds me... Remember a couple years ago? Somebody went missing... Maybe in Las Vegas or something? And they were last seen, like, acting totally crazy in an elevator? Or just, like, acting strange? What's she looking at? Something about to scare her? What's she looking for? Oh. 
What the f Was that? No, wait. Just like in the movie trailer. And. Weird. Did I press that? Pretty interesting. No. So she wasn't murdered by an evil boyfriend? It was the ghosts. Damn. Okay, where's these oil lanterns? Oh, these. Oh, is that why they would have them in the case? Oh. Whoa, there's a bloody handprint on it. Oh, shit. Is that the only one? Yeah. Saw this puzzle. Hate these puzzles. <laughs> Never mind. Whenever they don't make them too insanely difficult, where you can get it with just one go around, it's not too bad. Why does that guy's face get torn off that painting, too? Maybe... He was screwing with, like, some girls, and one of them died, and she ripped his face off the painting. Yeah, what the fuck? She doesn't like that guy. Oh, wait. Is that the guitar player guy? Lantern reveal. Hold space to explore with the animal lantern. Follow clues to find objects of interest. Aim the lantern at the center of an object and hold it there to reveal possible hidden items and images. Elevator, yeah, of course. Where is that? The physics are really good. Look at that thing. Boing. Okay, yeah, it's gotten pretty spooky. Whoa, okay. Here we go. What's this? Oh, shit. Liar. He? Who's that referring to? Oh, damn. Hey, let's go. What the hell happened here? That's what it says? What the hell happened here? I have a feeling the ghost would know. 
Hold on, I'm not gonna check the elevator just yet. Is there anything else? Okay, guess not. All right. Is that the ghost crying? Holy shit. To dispel the evil energy. Oh shit. Whoa. Again. You were on top of the display case too. What? Nothing. Yeah, right. There's evil energy in here, yo. Uh oh. Where's this taking us? It's midnight. Uh oh. The ghost does have a calendar. It's kind of cool. These Asian horror games like have these like spirits, like evil spirits, and you dispel them and stuff. It's kind of neat. Hello. I'm stuck inside the elevator. <laughs> it's midnight. What in heaven's name are you still doing here? What's your name? I don't want to see this. <laughs> Shit. What? This is so good. It's like a horror movie. I bet. Uh oh. Is this the ghost or is this Ting Ting? Why am I walking to her? Oh, oh, shit. When the symbols on the animal lantern fully light up, it will protect the carrier from one lethal ghost attack. After that, its energy must be fully recharged to avoid another. It's all right. Where do I go? Where do I go? Ah! E ah! I gotta run, I gotta run. Run faster. No, 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 no. Evil spirits. Evil spirits be gone. The power of Christ compels you. Or a Buddha or something. Oh shit. No! Let's try that one more time. Burn you bitch. Now run. I think I could have crouched to get through these. Oh, she's going to get me. She's going to get me. Ah, uh, she's gonna get me. She's so gonna get me. Come on, go, 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 go. Oh, 
Hopefully she can't crawl. Oh shit! Am I using it? Burn you bitch. Fuck yeah. Now run, 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 run. Charge, charge, charge. No. I have to start looking for the shortcuts. I think I can crawl under things to get around this quicker. It's not charged, it's not charged, it's not charged. I'm so dead. No. Uh oh. The story of Ting Ting relives itself once again. You better get that lantern ready. I see evil everywhere. Where's the lantern? Why'd you leave the lantern? She was also a reporter? Oh, that, oh no! <laughs> no! Oh, I thought the security guard was like running cover for the ghost and like they wouldn't eat him if he like supplied them with people to eat. But no, he is the ghost. This game looks awesome. Man, it looks so good. Cannot wait until it comes out. Definitely gonna wishlist this cause man, this is gonna make for a great couple streams probably. They are knocking this out of the park, it would appear. So, yep, uh, put it on my wish list and mark your calendars whenever a uh, date comes out because we're going to be playing this one for sure. All right, I've been the Chad. This has been another demo in my Halloween horror -thon. I will see you on the next one.